The development of new types of transportation has exponentially grown in recent history. The new abilities cars have today would have been unimaginable 75 years ago. The goal of creating self-driving cars is to reduce the risks associated with driving, allowing artificial intelligence or AI to take more responsibility. It's very likely that autonomous vehicles or AVs will become more integrated into society in the nearest future, but we aren't ready just yet. We require more research to investigate the technological, ethical, and psychological challenges that face AVs. It's important to know the goals of AVs when assessing their use in society. AI will have much more control over the vehicle, allowing the driver to not focus on driving. Research has been done and the use of autonomous vehicles will greatly decrease the number of accidents associated with driving. More sensors, cameras, and systems will be involved to ensure the safety of the vehicle and its passengers. In addition, using electric cars can help reduce the greenhouse gas emissions from standard gas cars. The technology involved in AVs must be enhanced to support the goals of self-driving cars. According to Jurgen from 2013, there have been studies demonstrating a vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle communication device that can help AVs communicate with one another. This short-range communication device will allow the vehicles to be connected to a network and react to one another. A way to think about this is that cars are connected to the GPS and can see any change in real time to the route and make an alternative route. With these capabilities, AVs will be able to reduce traffic congestion and make driving quicker. According to Lynn 2015, there is a fundamental difference in the decision-making process between an AI and a human. A human would react to a situation, whereas the AI would decide based on data, statistics, and programming. A potential accident could occur if a new scenario that is too complicated for the computer to respond to takes too long. More development of technology must be done to ensure the safety of everyone and to solidify the decision-making of these vehicles. Next, there are various ethical dilemmas that must be addressed before these vehicles can take over society. Another difference that sets AI and humans apart is their morality. The AI is just a computer. It will make decisions based on st statistics, probabilities, and programming. Lynn 2015 said that AI would make a decision that is programmed to cause the least amount of harm. This is a strong concept to build AVs off of, but it doesn't cover every inch of what happens on the roads. There are scenarios that where the driver has multiple options, all of which lead to the injury of someone involved. The AI would make the decision it thinks is the least harmful, but a human might choose differently to protect themselves first. Meyer et al. 2021. Humans and computers will vary in their decision making because humans will consider life and death morally. Although AI can provide the outcome with the least amount of harm, it still might not be the best solution to the problem. More research needs to be done to outline and complete the foundations of ethical questions in the decision making of self-driving cars. Lastly, there are psychological questions that need to be answered to allow AVs to be integrated into society. As stated before, there are numerous benefits that can come up with using AVs, such as greater driving efficiency, reduced risk of human error while driving, and optimized driving routes. To the public, these could all be reasons to support AVs. Lots of people love driving just to drive, as it takes their mind off things or allows them to debrief after a long day or test. If everyone is using AVs, they won't be able to do this anymore. Another negative would be the cost. The development, manufacturing, production, and purchasing of electric autonomous vehicles will not be cheap. It will also be expensive to repair these advanced systems and sensors. Auto shops might not be equipped to do this, so repairing AVs would also be expensive. For most people to support AVs, the cost must be addressed and made into an affordable price while maintaining the car is attainable and feasible. According to Wang 2023, AVs might not be integrated into society until 2040 or 2060 because of the, all the factors that have been addressed. With that said, it's extremely likely that they will be a large part of our life in the coming future. The safety advantages of reduced accidents and less possibility of human error need to be weighed with the lack of morality in decision making to determine what will be best for self-driving cars. Once the technology has advanced, the ethical and psychological concerns are addressed and the widespread population supports them, autonomous vehicles can be successfully integrated into society.